Okay, so these are the toss-ups for Musicians and Works, numbers 16 through 30 in the list covering the study guide that I've made for Quiz Bowl. So good luck. Toss-up number one. The father of this opera's title character hides behind a rock to discover the location of an army. Earlier in this work, that character claims that he is only an officer and that his true identity is dead. Its Grand March is set to a procession featuring elephants. The main character of this work sings O Patria Mia while waiting for a lover whom Ramphis later condemns and Amneris secretly loves. Radames is eventually sentenced to death by the pharaoh's priests after he falls in love with the title character of this opera who dies with him in a vault. For 10 points, name this opera set in Egypt about an Ethiopian Princess, written by Giuseppe Verdi. And that is Aida. Question number two. This composer wrote two sonatas and a quintet in B minor for the clarinetist Richard Muffeld, and he dedicated his violin concerto in D major to Joseph Joachim. He based a Passacaglia finale on, of his fourth and final symphony on a cantata movement by Bach, and he used text from the Luther Bible rather than the usual Latin liturgy for his principal sacred work. He quoted the song Gaudiamus Igitur in a piece he wrote after getting an honorary doctorate from the University of Breslau, and his first symphony is sometimes known as Beethoven's Tenth. For ten points, name this German composer of four symphonies, a German requiem, the academic festival overture, and a famous lullaby. And that is Brahms. Toss-up number three. The piece opens with triplets of octave chords of G. The title character is, uh, is sings that he is charmed by an unnamed child's beautiful shape and offers the child his mother's golden garments, his daughter's nightly dance, and promises to play games with him. The four parts are all sung by one person. Where a higher range signifies the child's part, a lower range signifies the father's part. The child is dying of an unknown ailment and is claiming to see the title figure, while his father is telling him that he only sees trees and clouds. For ten points, name this piece that uses Johann von Goethe's poem as leader, written by Franz Schubert. And that is the Errol King, the Errol King. Toss-up number four. A character in one of this man's works sings, Holy Elizabeth, pray for me, as he dies. The Libestod is sung at the end of one of this man's work, and this man created the principle of Gesamte Kunstwerk, or total artwork. This man's opera about Elsa and a titular hero was performed during his exile, and he used repeated light motifs for communion and the Holy Grail in his opera, Parsifal. In another opera by this man, Senta throws herself into the sea to free the flying Dutchman from his curse. For ten points, name this German composer who included Gotterdammerung and Siegfried in his Ring Cycle. And that is Wagner, Richard Wagner. Toss up five. This piece in E flat major borrows a melody from the composer's earlier opera, The Voyevoda, and it uses chromatic runs during the repetition of the piece's motifs. The folk tune, At the Gate, is reprised several times in this piece, and its finale sees the entrance of a brass band. Solo violas and cellos play the Russian hymn, O Lord Save Thy People, in this piece. As the French national anthem, La Marseillaise, is overtaken by the Russian anthem, God Save the Tsar, live cannons are called for fire. For ten points, name this piece that commemorates Napoleon's retreat in the title year, a piece by Tchaikovsky. And that is the 1812 Overture. Toss-up number six. Johannes Brahms spent his late teens as the touring accompanist for a violinist from this country. Countess Marie d'Algoul uh, had a daughter named Cosima with a composer from this country. A dance from this country speeds up from a slow Lassan section to a fast Frisca. A composer from this country wrote a set of 19 virtuoso piano pieces inspired by Rakowski March and a dance from this country called the Chardash. That composer from this country invented the symphonic poem and wrote 12 transcendental etudes. For 10 points, what Eastern European country names a set of dances by Johannes Brahms and a set of rhapsodies by Franz Liszt? And that is Hungary. Hungary. Toss-up number seven. This composer wrote a string octet in which he noted that pianos and fortos must be strictly observed. This composer of the aforementioned octet in E-flat major also wrote a violin concerto in E minor that was the first concerto to open with a solo violin instead of the orchestra. He included three Venetian boat songs in a collection composed of eight books containing six songs, each titled Songs Without Words, and he recreated the echoes of Fingal's Cave in his Hebrides Overture. For ten points, name this composer who wrote the incident dental music to A Midsummer Night's Dream. 
and that is Felix Mendelssohn. Mendelssohn. Toss-up number eight. A sequel to this work, Lilio portrays the central character awakening and conducting an orchestra. In the third movement of this work, the English horn and the oboe depict a conversation between two alpine shepherds while the timpani interrupts with claps of thunder. The strings play colengo or Legno in the final movement of this work, in which the bassoons and tubas play a somber dies iri, followed by the trombones as a part of a witch's sabbath. The ide fix appears in all five of its movements and represents the composer's love for the actress Harriet Smithson. For ten points, name the symphony by Hector Berlioz about a young artist poisoned with opium. And that is Symphony Fantastique. Toss-up number nine. One movement of this work is based on a design for the Marius Petipa Ballet Trilby. Another section of this composition begins with a bassoon playing five consecutive D sharps in its most famous or orchestration. A B-flat minor movement marked Andante in this piece depicts two rich and poor Jews arguing, while another depicts a hero at the gates of Kiev. Several sections of this piece are written in alternating 5-4 and 6-4 time and are known as promenades. This work was most notably orchestrated by Maurice Ravel, whose sections include the market at Lim... Lemoges, the hut on the hen's legs, Baba Yaga, and the old castle was based on a set of paintings by the artist's late friend, Victor Hartman. For ten points, name this piano suite composed by Modest Mussorgsky. And that is pictures at an exhibition. Toss-up number 10. In one of this composer's operas, Act Three Aria, In Vain Pour Eviter, sees a futile attempt to foresee the future. This composer adapted Donizetti's Don Pascale into his Don Procopio, and he also composed an opera in which a necklace given an aria, Come Altre Foi, provides safe passage to a couple that defies the edict against courting again, or during harvest season. That opera by this composer contains the aria, Al Fond du Temple, Saint, and the Friendship Duet. For ten points, name this composer who wrote an opera about Zerga, Nadir, Leela in The Pearl Fishers, and included arias like the Torridor song and Habanera in his Carmen. That is Bizet, Georges Bizet. Toss of eleven. This piece is to be played leggero as at a molto vivace tempo, and it opens with a right hand trill into the running eighth note melody four measures before the left hand begins playing quarter notes. This work in 3-4 time was inspired by the sight of a dog chasing its tail, and its nickname means small rather than its intended duration. For ten points, name this work by Frederick Chopin, a short waltz for solo piano that takes more than 60 seconds to perform and that is the minute waltz. Toss-up 12. In this work, the timpani plays a repeated D for several minutes during a complex fugue, concluding its third movement. Violins are omitted from its first movement, in which the recurring motif, F, A, B flat, is included by the sopranos. Opening with Selig Singd, Die da Lied Tragen, this piece's fourth movement, Ihir Habt Nun Traugikit, or Ye Are Now Sor Sorrowful, Sorrowful, was later added for the composer's mother. For ten points, name the seven-movement choral composition, which sets texts from Luther's translation of the Bible, rather than the Latin, a work by Johannes Brahms. And that is a German Requiem. Toss-up number 13. This composer wrote a piece for piano and orchestra based on a plain chant melody also found in Berlioz's Symphony Fantastique. That piece, a paraphrase on Dies Irae, is entitled Totentanz. One of his orchestral pieces was inspired by a poem by Alphonse de Lamartine. That piece, Les Preludes, is his third example of a genre that is, he is often credited with inventing the symphonic poem. His virtuosic piano pieces include 12 transcendental etudes, as well as a set of pieces whose Lassan and Frisca sections are inspired by gypsy music. For 10 points, name this 19th century piano virtuoso and composer of 19 Hungarian rhapsodies. That is Franz Liszt. Toss at number 14. The tone poem, Within Four Walls, begins this composer's sunless song cycle. An opera by this man includes a Slava theme and bell motifs in the second act, which both recur in a later coronation scene. Rimsky Korsakov's orchestration is the best known version of this composer's tone poem depicting a witch's Sabbath in the title location. A fanfare alternating between 5 4 and 6 4 time opens his most famous work, which features movements such as the Great Gate at Kiev and Promenade. A member of the Mighty Handful, for 10 points, named this Russian composer of Night on Bald Mountain. Mountain, Boris Gudinov, and pictures at an exhibition. And that is Modest Mussorgsky. Mussorgsky. Toss up 15. This opera character sings the provocative rods of the 
Sistrum's jingle song, and her entrance includes Love is a Rebellious Bird aria. She escapes by arrest by implying a guard will have a good time at Lilla's Pastivi Pastia's Tavern. While Escamillo is in the bullfighting arena, this woman is killed by Don Jose. In Act 3, this character reads fortunes predicting that death as this Georges Bizet character is a gypsy. For ten, <clears throat> for 10 points, give this opera character, who has the same name as a celebrity surnamed Electra, and a fictional crime villain, San Diego. And that is Carmen. Carmen is the name of that. Toss-up number 16. This composer transposed his first symphony from E-flat minor to E minor to make it more playable, and the Queen of Shimaka sings the Hymn of the Sun in one of his operas. Another opera by this composer of the Golden Cockerel includes the Dance of the Tumblers and ends when the title character's love for Ms. Gear causes her to melt. This composer of The Snow Maiden included recurrent Alborada movements in a work based on fashion Spanish folk music and also composed a suite based on 1001 Nights. For 10 points, name this Russian composer of Capriccio Espanol and Scheherazade, whose Tale of Sars Sultan includes the flight of the bumblebee. And that is Rimsky-Korsakov. Toss-up. Number 17. This opera sees one character sing a chardash to prove that she is Hungarian. Another character in this work takes a day off under the pretense that her aunt is sick while a notary initiates the canon brothers and sisters at the end of Act 2. A hungover prison guard disguised as Chevalier Chagrin hears the audition aria sung by a maid who poses as the actress Adele in this work. Shakun a Son Gout is sung by Prince Orlovsky at a ball where one character appears disguised as Marquis Renard. After his wife, Rosalind, proves her fidelity, that man, Baron Eisenstein, is forced to serve out his jail sentence. For ten points, name this Johann Strauss operetta about Falk, who is costumed as a costumed as the titular winged animal. And that is D. Fledermouse. Fledermaus, Johann Strauss. Toss-up number 18. Robert Schumann praised the heavenly length of this composer's last symphony, and this composer wrote the, the best-known sonata for a bowed guitar-like instrument called the arpeggione. Another of his chamber works substitutes a double bass for the usual second violin and has a fourth movement based on his earlier song, D.A. Forel, from which it gets its nickname. Among his other leader are Gretchen at the Spinning Wheel and one that provided the theme to the second movement of his 14th string quartet, Death and the Maiden. For ten points, name this Austrian composer of the Trout Quintet and an unfinished Eighth Symphony. And that is Schubert. Schubert. Toss-up 19. This object's theme consists of descending A minor thirds for four notes, which then reverse and ascend. A four-minute E-flat drone begins an opera titled for this object. The character who creates this object is forced to renounce love by some river maidens. After this object and Tarnhelm are stolen, the death-cursed motif is first heard. A fight over it leaves Hagen drowned and causes the rest of the gods to die in an inferno. A giant who possesses this object turns into a dragon. This object is created by the dwarf Alberic in the Rheingold. For ten points, name this object in which titles an operatic cycle, including Siegfried and the Valkyrie by Richard Wagner. And that is the Ring of the Nibelung. The Ring. Toss-up number 20. The dissonant minor second intervals of this composer's fifth etude led to its nickname, Wrong Note. This composer's opus 28 preludes one include one nicknamed Raindrop. His piano works include his Fantasy... Fantasie Impromptu in C-sharp minor, as well as the military and heroic Polonaises. He composed many mazurkas inspired by dances from his home country and carried on a 10-year relationship with George Sand. For 10 points, name this man who was inspired by November Uprising to compose his revolutionary etude, a Polish pianist and composer from the first hall half of the 19th century. And that is Chopin. Frederick Chopin. Toss up 21. One of the two mainstream theories, mainstream theories about this work notes that sketches for a scherzo part of it exist, and the ending of its slow second movement in E major clashes with the first movement in B minor. The other theory states that this work was proposed purposely broken up in order to create the entracte for the Rosamund incidental music. Whether this 1828 work was ever intended to have more than two movements is still subject of debate. For ten points, name this work, which was followed by the Great Symphony, a piece by Franz Schubert named for its incomplete status. And that is the Unfinished Symphony. Toss-up number 22. 
In one of this composer's works, a bird-like song, a bird-like flute, a bird song like flute introduces G major Landler played on solo zither. Another of his pieces features a glockenspiel in the middle section, but is otherwise consists only of plucked strings. In addition to D. Fledermaus and the Pizzicato Polka, which this composer co composed with his brother Josef, the and Tales from the Vienna Woods, he wrote a piece inspired by Emperor Franz Joseph's visit to Kaiser Wilhelm II. The title of one D major piece by him likely comes from Karl Beck's poem about the title River. For ten point, name this Austrian composer known as the Waltz King for such pieces as the Blue Danube. And that is Johann Strauss. Johann. Toss up number twenty three. One aria in this opera is in three eight time signature B major and describes women as flighty and constantly changing their minds. This opera, the vocal contains the vocal quartet Bella Fig Figlia dell'amore, in which it is revealed that one character is attempting to seduce. Madalina. In this opera's aria, Questa Oquella, the Duke expresses his desire to court Countess Soprano. In one scene from this opera, a title character of this opera is approached by the assassin Sparafusile. The most famous aria in this opera is La Donna Immobile. For ten points, name this Verdi opera about the title jester. And that is Rigoletto. Toss up 24. This man wrote the aria La Deplorable Fate, where the opera's titular women prepare to commit mass suicide when Greek soldiers demand treasure. He also wrote an orchestral arrangement to Weber's invitation to the dance. A viola represents the title character of his second symphony as he finds company with a dangerous crowd in the fourth movement titled Orgie di Brigands. This man wrote won the Prix de Rome. In addition to writing La Troyenne and Herald in Italy, he created a work in which an artist is fixated on a woman associated in a clarinet motif also called the Ide Fix. After taking opium, the artist dreams an execution in March to the Scaffold that sends him to a witch's Sabbath in hell. For ten points, name this composer of Symphonie Fantastique. And that is Hector Berlioz. Toss up number 25. One of these works opens Cachaturian's Masquerade Suite. A work in this genre by von Weber, Invitation to the Dance, was orchestrated by Berlioz and became the first concert piece of this type. Beethoven allegedly insulted one of these works as a cobbler's patch, but then wrote 33 variations on it. That piece was written by Antonio Diabelli. One piece in this genre evokes the image of a dog chasing its tail. The composer of that piece wrote 18 works of this genre that includes Missouri circas and polonaises. Johann Strauss Jr. was dubbed the king of this genre for writing pieces of this type named Emperor and Danube River. For 10 points, name this usually lively dance in 3-4 time. And that is a waltz. Toss-up 26. This man orchestrated an earlier composer's variations on a theme by Gluck, as well as Litz Liszt's transcription of an earlier composer's Ave Verum Corpus in his orchestral suite Mozartina. Mozartiana. This non-Beethoven composer wrote a symphony that begins with a fate motif, uh, motive and reappears in the finale. In addition to that F minor fourth symphony, he wrote a symphony with an unusual waltz-like movement in 5-4 time. Another of his orchestral works employs La Marseillaise and several cannon shots to depict the Battle of Borodino, from which it gets its title. For ten points, name this Russian composer of the Pathetique Symphony and the 1812 Overture. And that is Tchaikovsky. Toss up 27. Concert overtures based on this country are The Land of the Mountain and the Flood and a B minor one dedicated to Frederick William IV. Uh, movements titled Allegro Guerriero or Guerriero and Prominent Harp parts occur in a fantasy for violin and orchestra titled for this country by Max Brook and a symphony whose two four time scherzo evokes traditional snap dances. Confusingly, the publisher Breitkopf and Herotol titled an 1834 concert overture after one of this country's acoustic sea caves named for Fingal. It's Holyrood Chapel is evoked in Felix Mendelssohn's Third Symphony. For ten points, name this subnational country that contains islands depicted in the Hebrides Overture. And that would be Scotland. Toss up number 28. This composer's piano concerto features a solo for the cellos in its middle intermezzo movement. That concerto in A minor was originally written as a one movement fantasy. Fantasie. In one of his collections of piano works includes the often omitted movement Sphinxes in two movements that depict contracting, contrasting aspects of the composer's personality, Florestand and Eusebius. This composer of Carnival wrote a symphony named for poems by Adolf Bertiger. 
Another of his symphonies creates or features three trombones in the fourth movement, depicting a ceremony in the Cologne Cathedral near Namesake River. For ten points, name this composer of the Spring and Rhenish symphonies, husband of Clara. And that is Robert Schumann. Schumann. Toss up 29. This work's themes may have been taken from an unfinished E flat major symphony, though no program was ever released for it. It contains the then unprecedented notation of P P P P P P. Arnold Schoenberg described this work's finale as startling with a cry and ending with a moan. That finale is marked Adagio Lamentoso. Its second movement features a limping waltz in 5 4 time, and its composer died just nine days after its premiere. For 10 points, name this final symphony of Peter Tchaikovsky named for its expressiveness of emotion. And that is the Pathétique Symphony. Symphony Pathétique, which I think is number six, but I could be wrong. Toss-up number 30. At the beginning of this work, children celebrate in presto time with children's gallop and dance of the parents. The dance scene accompanies Hurl Dosselmeyer as he arrives with gifts for his grandson, Fritz. The Tempo di Valse concludes a series of ethnic dances, included the chocolate, the coffee, the dance of the reed pipes, and the tree pack. After saving the titular character from the Mouse King, Clara is brought on a journey by dolphins, where she is with foods from around the world. After the dance of the Sugar Palm Fairy, Clara awakens with, in her parlor with a crown in her hand. For ten points, name this ballet by Tchaikovsky about the titular Christmas toy. And that is the Nutcracker. Toss-up number 31. This composer wrote the Veil Song for the Empress Eboli in his Don Carlos. Before he composed one of his few comic operas, which was based on the Merry Wives of Windsor, this, his name became an acronym for an Italian unification movement. This composer of Falstaff had the Duke of Mantua sing about fickle women in La Donna Immobile in his opera Rigoletto. For 10 points, name this composer of Otello, La Traviata, and an opera about an Ethiopian princess who is buried alive, Aida. And that is Giuseppe Verdi. Verdi. Toss up 32. This piece, which is taken from an opera, is in the same act as the introduction of the 33 Balgotiers and the Swanbirds admonishment. A two octave chromatic descent characterizes this work written in A minor and is almost exclusively 16th notes. In the middle of this piece, a pizzicato A minor arpeggio takes over and the already fast chromatic motions around E increase in octave. This piece uses a solo violin to depict Prince Guidon, the protagonist of the tale of Sar. Sultan, who becomes a stinging insect. For 10 points, name this most famous work by Nikolai Rimsky-Korsakov, and that is The Flight of the Bumblebee. Flight of the Bumblebee. Toss-up number 33. There are only 36. A 2005 Salzburg production of this opera made Anna Netreb Netrebko, a superstar by putting her in a little red dress while her red couch surfed above the crowd of tuxedoed men. A character in this opera states that roses in the cheeks have paled in Adio del Passato. That woman traditionally sings an unwritten E-flat at the end of Sempra Libera. Upon learning that there is a pure and beautiful angel whose engagement is endangered by the indiscretions or indiscretions of Germont's son, the title character of this opera decides to return to the Baron. Abandoning Alfredo. For 10 points, I identify this opera about the tuberculosis-stricken courtesan, Violetta Valerie, by Giuseppe Verdi. And that is La Traviata. La Traviata. Toss up 34. This man's only completed symphonies are in E flat major and B minor as he died before finishing his A minor third. One of his most performed pieces is based on a tribe described in the Primary Chronicle, and another of his works, dedicated to Liszt, uses an English horn to portend the arrival of a camel caravan. For 10 points, named this composer of In the Steps of Central Asia, who created the Politzvian dances for his opera Prince Igor. And that is Borodin. Borodin. Toss-up number 35. Ricardo Drigo's revision of the score of this ballet moves a section for two merrymakers to the third act. Companies performing this ballet traditionally replace the character Benno with a jester or remove him altogether. The coda of Pa de Do in this ballet features a series of 32 virtuosic foets for the evil sorceress Odile, who is played by the same dancer as this ballet's heroine, but wears black instead. In this ballet, Siegfried chooses to die with his love, breaking the spell of von Rothbart. For 10 points, name this ballet by Tchaikovsky, in which Odette is cursed to take the form of a white bird. And that is Swan Lake. Toss up the last, number 36. 
American conductor Gunther Schuller offers a musical analysis on the unique solo improvisation techniques exhibited in a work whose title contains this word followed by seven. Another piece with this word in the title is notable for its Aksak meter, grouping beats into three measures of two, 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 three, and one measure of three, three, three. That piece is called This Word, Rondo a la Turk. Another song on an album whose name contains this adjective is characterized by alternating sections in D Dorian mode and E flat Dorian mode. That album, titled for this color, is by Miles Davis. For ten points, name this adjective used to describe a European river in a waltz by Johann Strauss II, as well as a rhapsody by George Gershwin. And that is blue, blue. So no exciting times in the last toss-up, but nevertheless, keep studying, keep learning, and uh, hopefully it'll pay off.